Hey, what's up guys? So we're back with another part of our tutorial series on the third person adventure game. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you um, how we can get the camera to rotate around our character and actually see where we're going because currently the camera just stands there and our character can run around, but we cannot um, follow him. So we want to be able to follow him. Now, as you can see, the scene has drastically changed from the last time. Now you can get this scene on the asset store. The link will be in the description. And as to everything that I'm going to be downloading from the asset store, I'm going to show you the things I'm downloading and you can see them over here. Um, so all of the things that um, aren't in my stuff, they're probably downloaded from the asset store somewhere. They're going to be given the links and credits and everything. So yeah. Now just before I start this video, I made a PayPal.me. Um, I do not like Patreon because I do not want you guys to donate monthly in return for something because I'm not really keen on providing things monthly um so if you guys want to help me out as you can see it's not uh it's not to me it's uh to my mom so all the money that you donate here goes to my mom because i'm helping her with um something other things not important so all the money is going to her so if you guys want to support me you're going to support her that way also and um yeah so hopefully if you like the things i do you can um chip in a bit so yeah now um i'm gonna continue enough talking so some of you have um um said that you don't like the animations that um come with unity the, for example the running animations and everything and uh, if you want to change them it's pretty simple to change them so you go to the third person player controller you click on the uh, animator controller and you can see um, it's not going to be like it's going to be like this now um these are animation layers the a layer when you're in the air when you're on the ground and when you're, when you're crouching so let's say for example you don't like the running animation so you click on grounded you click on this thing over here and it shows you all of the animations and how they go so this is basically a blend tree and uh, the blend tree it basically blends animations together so they look pretty good now, if you don't have a whole new animation set, I don't recommend like changing specific animations. Maybe if you have uh, ones for all the walking, right, left, sharp, etc., you can change them around. But um, I really, really recommend messing with it because the animations might look a bit wonky. But um, if you want, go ahead. You can always change it back if you don't like how it looks. So I, for example, I'm going to change the running animations. So... I've downloaded this um, RPG character animation pack. You can get it on the asset store for free. Link in the description. Uh, you can change it by um, going over here, uh, finding. So this is the running animation, and just drag it over here where the instead of this running animation. Also for the run left and right, but I'm not sure that this has a run left and right. Um, let's see. So unarmed, and let's see what animations they have. So attack run run yeah they don't have any this is like strafing and yeah so basically i'm just going to change this one we also have a walking one so maybe i can change the walking one all right so this is a walk slow and walk fast so uh, let's change it over here drag it into the walk one and now you basically change the animations which is pretty cool so now as you can see when you run he runs differently um you might like this one more you can do whatever so let's see the walking one is different as well if you don't like them you can always change them back so it's not that big of an issue so that's that now let's get to the main point of this video um the um the camera following so i wrote this i mean um i got the script i have written this one sorry um because i found it um, watching YouTube, I found this really cool channel. It has a lot of subs. You probably heard about it. It's called Sebastian League. Link in the description. He makes really good, really detailed, really very nicely explained things. I recommend you watching them. He had this little like third person controller thing uh, series and he used an animation. He used the script. He made it, I guess, for the third person camera, which is really good. So I'm gonna show you how you can set it up and uh, use the script. So this is the script um you can i'll uh, link uh, his github so you can download it from there because i do not want it to upload it to mine but basically you get the script you get your main camera 
uh, you drag the script onto the main camera. You get all these things so you can lock the cruiser if you want. And you have this target thing which you do not know what is. Now my models, as you can see, the pivot point is on the ground. So if you put this model on, um, if you put the third person controller on the target, the camera is basically going to zoom in on his pivot point, which are his feet, but we do not want that. So go ahead and create a empty game object, make it a, make it a player and make it a child of your um, third person controller. Call it target, I guess. Uh, reset the position and you can drag it up to his I guess to his chest a bit more all right so that's where the camera is gonna be now go to the third person go to the main camera and instead of the target you're gonna put target over here you can um, play around with these values for example let's put this to one and now when we play the game you can see that we have a camera that fully orbits around your character if you put it over here, he's going to start walking that direction or running. So as you can see, the animations look a bit wonky because I changed them. I guess I'm going to change them back or something. So uh, yeah. So that's pretty much it for this tutorial. Um, hope you enjoyed. Uh, leave me in the comment section what you want to see in the next video because I was planning on doing AI and everything and um, interaction. A AI just walking around and seeing other like models of AI of players like do whatever like pick up chop wood um, I was thinking about doing that and I'm gonna do that but if you guys want to see something else be sure to comment in the description into the comment section sorry and um, I'll read about it and might do it so yeah see you next time bye